Hello everybody, my name is Basie Base and welcome to my first ever video. Yes, welcome to my first ever video. Yay! Well, it's not my first ever video, but it's my first video in my channel. Yes, because me and Bearforce, me and my boyfriend, we made uh, four videos of Counter Strike. Yes, playing Counter Strike. It's really amazing and cool game. It's really amazing and cool game. Yes. It's really smart, you have to think for everything and I'm trying my best. <laughs> well, it, it's it's really smart, you have to think how to throw the grenade, you have to think how to throw the smoke, where to throw it, where to throw the flashbang, when, how to aim, where to aim, and it's a really amazing and smart game. Yes, we did uh, four uh, episodes of Counter-Strike, we did uh, two videos of me as a Greek person trying sweets and candies from Sweden and they are really tasteful and really mmm they're delicious Mwah. <laughs> they're delicious but we are going to talk about it later yes so today my video I'm going to talk about Sweden yes oh yes it's really beautiful and amazing and wonderful country Yes, and I'm going to talk about Sweden and how my experience was um, because we, me and my bear force, we were supposed to make a video um, about me talking how it was my experience and how it was my my two and a half months there. But we had, we were, um, we wanted so much to spend uh, the the few days and hours together we wanted to spend uh, together the time that left so we didn't really do the video but <laughs> yes but now i'm gonna have to do that i'm going to do that because um, my very first did a video and said if i was i wasn't so shy and I'm, I really am because it's my first video ever now and I'm, I'm really shaken, and I'm really sensitive and I'm really <laughs> shy so um, I'm gonna do that now <laughs> I'm gonna talk about Sweden and how beautiful and how amazing how wonderful it is and what the places, well all the places are so beautiful but where we went I will talk about yes so I'm really I'm gonna have to do that now yeah <laughs> although I'm shy yes he said that I am shy I'm really shy and I am indeed um, I I was thinking all the time to do the video but uh, <laughs> I'm so sad that I'm thinking oh I'm gonna do that tomorrow oh, I'm gonna do that tomorrow I'm gonna do that tomorrow <laughs> the day came I was supposed to do it earlier earlier when I went when I came back home in Greece, I was supposed to do that earlier when I saw the video of my bear verse. Yes, but I was really shy to do it, to do it, and I was left with leaving it. <laughs> but now I'm gonna do that. Yes. So, 28th of March, it was my first ever flight, and I was going in Sweden. Yes, um, Bear Force, my Bear Force, uh, came two times in Greece. He came one in October the first time, and it was really amazing, so magical. I couldn't believe it. Yes, it was so wonderful to see him in real life because we were sending messages, we were sending uh, Viber messages, and we were sending videos, photos, and we were talking on Skype, and that was really amazing. It was so magical. Yes. Uh, he came in October and at the airport I was so nervous I was so happy to see him in real life yes uh, um, I'm fan I'm a fan I was watching all the videos from <laughs> uh, Bear Force's channel yes um, we met on Twitter yes uh, well I think you you know that but yeah I'm gonna say that too. Uh, we met on Twitter, uh, a YouTuber that all you know, all you follow, I guess. <laughs> it's a really known YouTuber. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna say that, but <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm not gonna say the name. But um, he made a comment for the video, for the comment I think it was, or the video that uh, this YouTuber made, and he had a comment 
and I commented down to the comment of Ben first, yes. And it was really nice, uh, we followed each other and it was really nice, so magical, yes. So he came October and he came December, yes. So um, it was my turn to go in Sweden and that was so amazing, it's so beautiful and thank them so much uh, for staying there two and a half months, yes. <laughs> Um, it was a great time, an amazing Easter, yes, it was, it was really, really cool and thank them, I'm, I'm thanking them so much, his family, it's so wonderful and so amazing, they are so wonderful and amazing, yes, it was, it was really nice, thank you so much, yes, and, uh, well, we had an amazing time there, it was my first ever experience <laughs> taking the flight. Well, I'm going abroad every year. Well, now it stopped it a little, but every year um, I'm going in Czech uh, to see my grandparents and my uncle and my aunt and my cousins and everything. My mom is from Czech and my dad is from Greece, so I'm a half half. Yes! Eee. <laughs> That's nice! Over and over. <laughs> so yeah, but I didn't really took ever a flight, so it was a first experience for me too. But it was really nice. I wasn't afraid of the flight. Uh, it, w it was good because some people then their, their first flight, it's not like they're oh my god, I'm so afraid to take the flight. I'm so afraid about the airplane. What it will happen and everything. Well, of course, I'm, I was thinking of it too, like every people. Like every person is thinking of that, yeah. But um, I wasn't afraid. I was really wanted to go uh, to see my bear first, my love. Yes, um, it, it was really nice, and I, I was thinking all the time, oh, when I'm going to take the airplane, I'm now at the airport. I'm going to take the airplane, and then I will be in Sweden, and that was really nice. And I wanted so much. So I wasn't thinking about the flight so much. <laughs> Yes, I was so happy and so hyped that I was going uh, because I missed him. I missed him so much for those three months. I think it was or two and a half months. Yes, from January that he left uh, from Greece and went back home in Sweden until 28th of March that I took the flight. Yes. I missed him so much uh, and I'm really missing him now because now it's July no it isn't July it's June whoops <laughs> it, it's June uh, soon it will be July and 25 of July I'll be in Sweden yes again yay I'm so excited I'm so happy that I will see him again yes I miss him so much it's it was so hard so hard and so difficult to leave yes but i i am thanking them so much because the, the days and the weeks and the two and a half months that i passed there it was really nice so beautiful i really miss it i can't wait about 25 of July again to go and see the mall see my very first because i miss him so much and it was really hard to be at the airport it was bear force and it was my bear force and his mom and they were waiting with me to take the flight and it was really hard because i knew that the <laughs> it was only a few hours and a few moments and then the flight <laughs> was going to go and I was I remember that time that I was in the line uh, so many people in the line and I was uh, yeah and it was really really hard because I remember that I was crying so much <laughs> I, I was feeling that, that I will miss him so much and I was missing him so much <laughs> Yes, it, it was really hard and I miss him so much. I can't wait about 25 of July and I'm crying like a little baby <laughs> again. But uh, I miss him so much. It's, it's really hard. <laughs> uh, but now it's two, and a, it's two and a half months. It's not three exactly months. Um, yes. So now, the 25th of July, I'm taking the flight and going back in Sweden to see my love. 
yes, my very voice. And I'm really hyped. I can't wait. I miss him so much. It's it's really hard. But yeah. So now I'm going to continue um, telling you about my experience in Sweden. You have to hear it. You have to see it because I'll I'll put in the video <laughs> somewhere there uh, photos so you can see it. So. Um, Sweden, it's such an amazing and beautiful country. Uh, my very first said that we wanted to make a video um, about saying my experience in Sweden and the best things about me visiting Sweden and special moments. Well, it's really hard to say special moments because all of them they were so beautiful and so special to me. So I don't know, I don't know. It's really difficult to say one or two special moments. It's really all. It was all special to me. And best thing, I don't know. Well, the best thing was that I was seeing Berfors again, and I was with him for two and a half months. That was the best thing ever. Uh, how about me visiting Sweden? Yes. Yes, so my best thing ever, um, I don't know, special moments, everything, everything. Every time that we had, um, I don't know, every, I mean, it's, it's really hard to say a special moment because it's, it's really hard. It's every moment that we had, uh, that we were together, it was all special to me and I can't really find a special moment because it was all. It was really all. And my best thing about visiting Sweden it was my love to see him again. Uh, yes, and do so many stuff, do so many things. So, special foods. Well, special foods. If you have to say about foods, not sweets and candies. Food. I really like fish balls. You have to try them. They're so delicious. Oh my god. They are so delicious as a food, uh, fish balls, meatballs, well meatballs, uh, it's really delicious too, I really know it as a Greek person too, yes, but fish balls, they are so delicious, oh my god, you have to try them, oh yes, you have to try them, they are really delicious, what else about foods, there are a lot of foods that I was eating, but some of them they are uh, similar to our foods in Greece but some of them well I knew some of the plates that they were similar to Czech Republic too so fish balls it's my best food and my special food it's fish balls yeah <laughs> you have to try it about mm, special sweets and candies from Sweden well you have to check uh, the video, I'll put the link down in the description below so you can see it, yes, go and see it, go and see, yes, he is really amazing and so cool, we did uh, um, two amazing videos of uh, us uh, trying uh, sweets and candies from Sweden, me as a Greek person to see my experience in sweets, but it, I don't know if it's the thing that I really like all the sweets and candies and chocolates and everything but yeah they're all so delicious mm. <laughs> yes marabou dame damn <laughs> yes Polly um, they're all so sweet and so delicious the monkeys the red monkeys ow I forgot the name, but you will see it in the video down in the description below. Yes, um, Marabou, Dame, Polly, Kex, and well, Kex, it's my first sweet in the list. Yes, Kex, and then Marabou and Dame and everything. <laughs> oh yes, they're so delicious. Oh, my God. There's so 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 many other sweets and candies. Uh, about dreams, about dreams that I tried in the video, that we tried in the video too, it was Trocadero, mm -hmm. oh yes, and another, another, mm -hmm. oh. it was similar to Trocadero, I really don't remember <laughs> the name, oh, yeah. yeah, 
I really found it. Champis. Oh yeah, they're really tasteful. They're really delicious. Yeah, you have to try them. So yeah, that's something for foods and sweets and candies. Stockholm and Estonia was our first cruise. Yes. Well, Stockholm, it was. I was at the airport. We were at the airport. He took me from there. So I was in little for in Stockholm, and then we went for a cruise to Estonia. So we had to go again to Stockholm, and it's a really beautiful um, town. It's it's really amazing. All the beautiful buildings and yeah, it's really similar to Prague, like Czech. Yes, we had to go there. I thank him so much for the beautiful and amazing cruise. It was so magical. It was so good. Yes, we had so many amazing and beautiful stuff there. Funny moments too. Yes, it, it was really. Um, it was an amazing, ex good experience and nice and beautiful and wonderful experience. Yes, going to Stockholm going around the city, um, watching everything, taking photos of everything. I'll put some photos somewhere on the video <laughs> so you can see it, yes. And then we were taking the ship to go to Estonia. Well, Estonia, Tallinn, we, were, we went to Tallinn. The city gates in Tallinn, that was such a beautiful and amazing um, place. Town Hall Square in Tallinn. It was really beautiful and magical too. It was similar like Prague. It's it's really beautiful. You have to see it. If you have any opportunity to go in Sweden, go. You you have to go. It's a really beautiful and magical and wonderful country. You have to see all the beautiful places and views. Well, it's not only Stockholm. I guess it's all Sweden. So beautiful. So you have to see it. A very good nature, green nature. That's, that's really amazing. Rivers, lakes, and everything. Forests. Yes. That, that's a really cool and beautiful about Sweden. Well, Czech has that too. One other country is about has it too. But forest, you can do Orient Dream. I didn't knew, but my math therapist said that if you want to go to a forest or if you want to go to a field for that is someone else's field, you can go. It's <laughs> they don't have a law that like here in Greece or in some other countries too. But if you will walk in another's field, they they don't let you to go there. They have it closed or something. So it's it's really nice. It's a free country. It's really beautiful, but also it's safe to Yes. So you can do re-entering it. I didn't know that, but it's a really good athletic sport. Yes, it, it's really amazing. Yeah, you have a map, you have a compass, and you're running uh, inside the forest, in the fields, everywhere, and it's really really nice. Yes. Um. I will put the link in the description below too, you, so you can see it. Yes! I'll um, put so many links in the description below. <laughs> yes, so it's really, really amazing. Uh, another experience that I had, we had together with uh, my Bearfors and his family. It was that day that we went to so many beautiful places like zoo. It's so amazing. <laughs> wild animals like bears, polar bears, tigers, <laughs> cool, oh my god, <laughs> that was really cool stuff, yes, so we went there, we went for skiing, it was my first ever trying skiing and it was really cool, and thank them so much for teaching me how to ski, I didn't know that, also I didn't know how to ice skating, and that was hard too, <laughs> But I found it easiest the skiing, the ice there, than ice skating. Yes, because we had an ice skating uh, back in Christmas when he came. Went to a city in Greece, and we had so many stuff to do, and we went for ice skating, and it was really hard. I have to say, I was falling all the time. <laughs> 
Oh my god. Oh yes. It was really hard, but I thank him so much because he was taking care of me. <laughs> so good. But I was still falling. Yeah, I was still falling. Yes, but uh, skiing it was really nice and easiest than ice skating. <laughs> yes. So we went there. Another amazing and cool experience uh, that we had, that I had, and then it was Dalla Horse. Well, I have to say, in the city that he is, that, uh, yes, I'm not gonna say the city, but <laughs> it's really, 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 really amazing and beautiful. He, they have a Dalla Horse that it's so big and so huge. Yes! Oh my god, that was really, really cool. I put a photo, photo somewhere. <laughs> yes. And that day that we went to the zoo and did skiing, we went to a Nils Olsen boutique. It was all horses, Dalla horses. And there were also chickens, I think. Yes, and they had the, the same pot pattern, like the horses, the Dalla horses, the colors and everything. And I didn't know. I I know that the Dalla horses, like like this, like this, they are red, red, and other beautiful shapes and everything in other colors. But I didn't know that Dalla horses are red, are yellow, pink, green, orange, gray, white. The white is so beautiful. Then it's gray and pink together, and such an amazing combination of colors. Yes, I didn't know that you can make other like blue. I said blue, I don't know. I said blue. <laughs> yes, and it was really amazing to see all the combinations, all the color combinations together. It was really, really nice. Yes. So the people that they're doing this. Uh, they are making so many different kind of shapes in the horses so it's not all the horses the same it's the same pattern like uh, the shape of the green the yellow the, the orange how it can be the horse and what the color but they are making some difference in every horse so it's really amazing to see it yes it's the Nils Olsen boutique it's really beautiful, it's really amazing how they can do all this stuff. Yes, it, it's really cool, I have to say. It was really cool to see it, how they can do it. Yes! And uh, the, the people that they were doing this, the, they showed us how, somehow, how they are doing this with the wood and everything, how they can do the scratching and doing it with a, with a knife and everything, and it's really, really cool. But it's a hard work, yes. For them, it's not a hard work now, I guess, because the, they know everything. It's really easy for them, but it's really hard to do it. Yeah. I really have a, a wooden that they gave me. They gave me, yes. And it's, it's really hard to do it. I didn't do it yet. <laughs> I didn't do it. It's, it's only wood. You have to uh, scratch it with a knife, I think. We ha uh, you have to paint it and all this stuff, but I'm leaving it like that. I really like it like a wood, wood, wood horse. And in the end, I have the, the pink one. <laughs> yes, it's tiny, but it's so cute. Yes. So it's a really amazing experience to be in Sweden. Yes. So if you will have any opportunity to go in Sweden, just go. Don't think about it don't think about it you have to go it's a really amazing beautiful wonderful country you have to go and see all the places yes um, Stockholm Estonia Finland that's really good too. yes we had a small cruise in Finland and it was really nice and so sweet it was it was such an amazing two and a half months um, and if you ask me what is my best thing about me visiting Sweden, my special moments, of course I will say uh, Sweden, the country, the beautiful and amazing views, the forest, the Dalla horse, um, the Shansai, yes, the amazing night that it was light uh, around 3 o'clock one or two o'clock and now as a summer they have light all the time yes 
um, foods, sweets and candies, of course I will say, but my first best thing about me visiting Sweden, my special moment, it's my bear first. Yes. Uh, it's my very first. It's my best thing about me visiting Sweden. It's my very first because I really miss him so much. Um, I missed him so much, and now I'm missing me, missing him so much. I missed him back before I went for the first time in Sweden, and now I'm miss him, missing him. Um, and I can't wait about 25 of July. Yes. Um, I can't wait. I miss him so much. It's really hard to to leave and to know that you have two and a half months until the next um, meeting, until the next uh, flight, it, it, it's really hard. Yes, so 25 of July then, yeah, perhaps I'll make a vlog. I don't know, I, I'm shy, but I, I hopefully do it. <laughs> I, will, I will try to do it, yes. So, th that was my best things about me visiting Sweden. Um, so yeah thank you so much old for watching this video i hope you liked it uh, i really hope you liked it although i'm i'm talking i'm, I'm crying like a little baby yes and i'm shy that too but i really really thank you so much for watching the video i really hope you enjoyed it and if you have ever any opportunity to go in sweden or all around the world you have to go, you go, don't think about anything, yes, you have to go, it's a really magical and wonderful and beautiful country, you have to see all the beautiful views and all the beautiful cities, yes, you have to see it. So, thank you so much all for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it, yes, so I will see you soon in the next video.